I would like to uh, take this opportunity to welcome everybody back and I hope you came back refreshed and uh, we're anxious to uh, have a wonderful 2019 and we want to wish you the best. We would like on behalf of Parkland School Division to offer condolences to the family of uh, Dr. Diane McConnell, our Associate Superintendent of Schools whose son Ben recently passed away and uh, our thoughts are with Roy and Diane and family at this time. Uh, ben was a wonderful young man who really exemplified some tremendous traits of curiosity. He was inquisitive, he had a love of life, and he had a resiliency to overcome uh, handicaps and hardships. And these are things that we want to instill in our children, so he set a wonderful example for us. We want to do some proactive planning. Uh, there's a, 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 surprisingly, Edmonton Public has a wonderful division that does a great job in doing this, and we've employed them to do our study for us. And this allows us to see where our population pressures are, how we're utilize, utilizing our facilities, and uh, be able to do some future planning. What the board has also asked the, uh, the administration to uh, take a look into different funding scenarios that we may be encountering in the next few years. It doesn't matter the political climate in the fall. We do know that uh, we're in tough economic times in Alberta. But we, we wanted to look at uh, the, some uh, different scenarios, a 3% decrease for three years, a 5% decrease for three years, a funding freeze for four years, and also if they just cap uh, and not pay for future enrollment uh, for four years. And this enables us to just be a little bit more prepared should any of these scenarios hit us. And we do know that we're running a huge deficit and a projected deficit of $700,000 this year. And we do know that that's gonna start impacting the, the classroom and we feel the funds need to get back to where they belong. So we're doing a complete review of transportation, and it is very detailed, uh, but uh, we are taking under, taking about three or four initiatives to help improve that, and uh, hopefully we can reduce that deficit or eliminate it. Uh, we need to get to some more realistic uh, uh, charges for uh, people using our buses, and there may be some changes in the way we offer our services. Parkland School Division, where the world opens up.